flat creek grayling new stream just pulled over the side of the road black creek slough dry with a dropper, two grayling. So I changed flies because he broke me off on another one. Beautiful grayling. So I'm uh, heading for salmon, and uh, this is out the front window of the truck. And I saw the uh, bikers with the panniers on the side of their bikes. That's a long haul wherever they're going, because there ain't nothing out here. But you can see the uh, Elias Wrangell uh, Mountains in the foreground there. I'm heading that way. Maybe I'll get a good shot. Okay, so filming again. Now you can see the uh, the range coming up here. As a matter of fact, there's a pull off, so I'm gonna take one with a 35 millimeter. Okay, so that's a good view of the Elias Wrangell Mountain Range. Um, walking, so you can see this big one to my right.
went out to Denali today, but on the way back, truck overheated, had to pull over. I'm starting to have not so good a day until I found this little dock pond by the state. So let's just see what we got going. So I'm throwing a mosquito pattern because there are thousands of mosquitoes. Billions, really, more like it. The joke is it's the state bird. Hey, we got another mosquito pattern tied on behind my little pink indicator fly. It's almost midnight here. Still light, but Bart's bad eyes can't see my indicator, I mean my mosquito fly. And that's what happens right there. And I kind of cheated because I knew this fly would work because this is like my fourth fish in about six or seven casts. They're small, but they're fun, and occasionally there's a big one on the water that hits. But little pretty rainbows hitting that mosquito. So we'll show you again how easy this is. There's the cast. There's the fish. They love these mosquitoes because they have a nice diet of them. I mean, there's mosquitoes like you just wouldn't believe. And what's funny now is they're hitting my top indicator fly. The one with a little pink on it. 